Hey guys, hi, thanks for joining me. Hey, this is the first video in a series of videos that I'm gonna be doing, just real quick ones on tips about makeup, skincare. Uh, I've got like 30 years of vast knowledge of uh, how to do and what not to do in the world of makeup and skincare. And I wanna pass these things on to you, and particularly for women, you know, you guys that are getting over 50, even even if you're not, these tricks and all these tips will still apply to you. Um, in, in my demographic, well, I'm going to be 60 in two months, so, uh, you know, around about either younger or older than me. Um, I've got a lot of ideas for you. So what is this about? It's about exfoliation. I'm going to teach you how to exfoliate your skin properly without having to buy any expensive products, without any uh, expensive trips to the dermatologist. So anyway, I'm getting to it. I'm going to show you a really great way to exfoliate your skin. So, um, and these are it. This is it. It's a simple, it's a super simple. It's, it's these really, these are really cheap, um, nubby little washcloths that I buy and I buy them a pack of like 12 for uh, $3.99 at the most maybe $2.99 at Walmart these literally come from Walmart I've never seen them anywhere else and they are the best way to exfoliate your skin easily uh, effectively and for basically just the initial cost of these cheap little washcloths um, so what they do is well, here's a, they come in these funny colors. This is a beige colored one. Look at it. See it closely? See how nubby that is? I mean, it's, it's, they're, when they, and when they get really old, they get almost transparent. I mean, I think the more you wash them, the more I even like them. Um, yes, they're super nubby. Um, expensive washcloths generally have, they're that Egyptian cotton and they're really soft and they're, oh, they're lo so luscious and they feel so good. And they're absolutely completely ineffective and don't do anything other than a delivery surf, a, a delivery uh, method for running your cleanser across your skin. But you don't, you don't want to just, you know, suds up your makeup. You want it to scrub into your skin and get all those dead skin cells off as well as getting every bit of makeup off. Well, they will not irritate your skin. I suppose there are people out there that are really super sensitive then that may say, you know, it is too rough for my skin, so just use common sense and back off. Don't scrub as hard, don't use it as often, or don't at all. But So how you use them, um, <laughs> pick your color, any color. Look, they bought the Mexican flag in here, I think. Um, use your, just squirt your cleanser on to a nice damp washcloth. Get a good cleaning all over. Um, I really like to exfoliate on the T-zone around the nose, the chin, and the forehead. They work awesome. The benefits of exfoliation, oh my God, your makeup goes on beautifully. If, you're, if your skin is not exfoliated properly, if your skin is rough and has a lot of dead skin cells laying on top of it, your skin, your, your foundations will not go on properly. They will go, they will actually will highlight, your foundation will actually highlight your rough, dry skin. Dead, dry, flaky skin mixed with oil, makeup, dirt, that is what impacts your skin, impacts your pores, and what creates blackheads. And what happens when blackheads come into contact with uh, bacteria, back, natural bacteria from your skin, that bacteria, those blackheads turn into pimples. So that's where zits are formed. And so the best way to reduce or completely eliminate any kind of breaking out on your skin is to exfoliate on a regular basis really super important i cannot stress it enough so i've been in the beauty industry now for what 30 years and it always never ceases to amaze me how many women ignore really important um beauty care treatments uh when exfoliation is probably the biggest one i just it's a, it's, it's a constant amazement to me of how many women i really have to convinced that this is an important service to do to your skin. And for those of you who are already exfoliating your skin, congratulations, pat yourself on the back, I'll bet your skin looks great. And, I, and for those of you who are on the fence about it, I'll tell you one thing that I think ought to convince you, and that is that uh, exfoliation, it makes you look younger. It makes your skin look fresher and younger. And while I totally am, am embracing the aging process now, i have come into terms with turning, to, turning 60 in two months, um, I still want to, I just, I don't want my skin to age that quickly. I want, I want to keep my skin as youthful looking as possible. There's a lot of things that I'll let go, but, um, as time goes by, but letting my skin just 
you know, not take, taking good care of it and letting it just go and just age faster than it should. Um, hey, I'm not, I'm not into that. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to, that part, I'm going to take as good care, take as good a care of it as I, as I can. Okay. So to wrap this up, uh, make a trip to Walmart and get yourself a pack of these washcloths. I found these in the, one of those end caps, um, at the end of the aisle. They're in a bin, um, they have the, a big stack of them with uh, a ribbon wrapped around them. Also too, when you use washcloths, and I wash my face in the shower every morning, um, and I have a little spot in my shower where my washcloth can lay across and completely dry out. You don't want your washcloth to stay wet. Anything that stays wet will gather bacteria and musty, and you don't want that to happen. So. Um, if it stays wet, toss it out and get a new. I mean, you really should change your towel probably every two days. And with 12, that shouldn't be a big deal. I mean, gosh, buy yourself two packs if you don't want to do your laundry that much. And, um, yeah, I mean, this is these are amazing. This is a great... I've never heard anybody tell this trick before. Something I discovered, and I have been exfoliating my skin with using these for probably a good 10 years now. And I swear to God, my skin... I mean, my skin's a lot of things. And, yeah, I got these, like, you know, and I want to get a lift let next year and get this neck pulled up down I want to do the lower part down here seriously thinking about it you know the lower and I hate the that yeah I hate that thing but um, my skin is small soft and my skin is smooth so you know I don't know um, so if you got any good ideas or good methods for exfoliation or any good skincare ideas or even anything you want me to talk about um, Leave me a comment below. This is going to be on Facebook. This could be on YouTube. This could be anywhere, you know, that you can leave a comment. Uh, and let's keep the conversation going. Tell me what you think. I would really appreciate some feedback from you. So, um, okay, till next time. Ciao.